All right, look, I'm gonna show you how to how to uh, use your Zen or Cronus on PS5. So you're gonna wanna go to WinRAR, all the links in the description. And then once you come here, you just wanna press this blue button. This is the first thing you're gonna wanna download. Then you wanna go over to uh, Microsoft Runtime. It's gonna bring you here, you're gonna wanna download this one right here. This Time 64. After you download that, you're gonna to to go here. You're gonna to wanna to download this. I already have it downloaded, but I'll download it. I'll just put it on my desktop. And then once you do that, you're gonna to wanna to minimize like this. Drag your, create a new folder right here. Name it whatever you want. Then you're gonna wanna drag this into it. Go like this. Right click on it. Extract here, it's gonna pop up a whole bunch of stuff. And then you're gonna wanna click on you're probably gonna wanna open it. But after you have the runtime, the Microsoft runtime downloaded, it should open up. And then after you do that, after you got that set up. I want to come here to uh, PlayStation Remote Play. It's going to bring it here. Go all the way down. Check this box. Download it. And then once you have all of that downloaded, I want to come over here, open it up. But first, before you do that, PS4 is Windows. If it's working, it'll show your controllers right here. So that's how you know it'll be working. And once those are working, you want to go over to Remote Play, open it up. It's going to have you sign in. I'm already signed in. Then you just click on, you can just click on like whichever one you want. But it's mainly for PS5. Click on it, click yeah. It's going to wait for it to connect. Turning on my PS5 right now. And then you should be good from here. All right, but once, like when you do this, when you get to this page, you don't want to have to click this. You're going to want to click this microphone. You're going to want to have your headset plugged into your PC. But whenever you play, when you play on it, you're going to want to, uh, have an ethernet cord in your PS5 and your PC. And whenever you're playing the game, don't look at your PC. Like don't watch this. Don't watch the remote play. Like minimize it and then watch your PS5. Then you should be good to go.